was just said, if you understood, this is the body of the man. I hope I've never been a good drawer. It's a bit lopsided. I think he's got something called the leg too. If the man takes 80% of his energy from his environment, which is totally loose. Now, you understand the fallacy of the science of the man. The heart of the man sits within the structure of the lung of the man. As we say in English, what is good for the goose is good for the gander. If you are absorbing 80% of the energy from the environment around you, now you understand the conversion of the energy which is given to the blood to come to the heart, it can't be more than 20%. The heart gets most of its energy directly from the conversion from the lung. Then, you understand, you don't need that much working for the heart to let it rest. So, the heart itself to energize the blood, the way it comes in, it doesn't get energized by transfer of energy just as it goes through the heart. Because the energy received from, by the heart from the lung is 80% of it. And then, if you understood this, you understand how the Indian guru was feeding himself. The way you change the position of the lung, you change the energy, and through it, you feed the emotion, you reduce the consumption of the energy in the physical part, because now you're transferring plasma to plasma. You're not transferring matter to the direction of the plasma. So, the energy transfer is so fast, but because it goes through the wall of the body of the man, through the heart, the same, now you can control emotion very rapidly with it, the control of the heart. Is the emotion in energy transfer which creates the condition of the heartbeat and not the other way around. You feel safe in respect to the environment, 60 over whatever is good, or 90 over whatever is good, or 12 over whatever is good. What do you do in high blood pressures now we use in cancers? All you do, you change the environment within the body, the field transfer, and then in turn affects the blood pressure. Because you work, through the energy of the plasma, you don't work through the energy of the matter state of the blood. You touch the emotion. When we use CO2 and zinc oxide, we elevate the emotion of the man, which affects directly through the emotion of the physicality, through the heart, to the brain of the man and the emotion conversion of the energy from the soul. I am